The South Korean ambassador to Uganda, Park jong de has called for a multi-pronged approach to address the moral and cultural degradation among the youth. He was speaking at a South Korean cultural festival in Kampala. The event was organized to celebrate 15 years of good political and economic cooperation between Uganda and South Korea. This kind of uh, popular culture, expansion uh, and exhibition of popular culture is also helpful because uh, it brings uh, our new generation into this field, back to the field of uh, what is important inherently in our human being, which transcends language and transcends barrier. It's like a music, dance, and uh, which uh, has a commonality in our human being. The Minister for Tourism, Maria Mutagamba, underscored the need for Ugandans to protect their diverse culture and singled out South Korea as the best example for the Ugandans. That for us in tourism, especially in Africa, our biggest drive or the, the biggest niche that we have is about culture. Because not so many countries to showcase the music the rich culture and dance prowess at now, disappointed. Like one, Goa, you know, the fineness news, of their Kampala. drum, the fineness of their dance, the fineness of behavior. We have a lot to learn from them. But if you are going to go out to display our culture, we must exhibit that fineness because that's what they expect from us. She observes that culture is one of the top tourism products for the country. The youthful, traditional and contemporary South Korean dance group Legend K entertained the audience. Dennis Igoa, UBC News, Kampala.